What is going on, you guys? Steve with the video for you today. So today we're going to do a player spotlight, and it's going to be of Ray Fossey, nicknamed the Marion Mule. But before we get into some Fossey information and cards, I just want to give a quick channel shout out to uh, Brian over at Hodges1455. So Brian, you know, he's a big uh, Pittsburgh Pirates fan and Pittsburgh in general. And, you know, one thing I really like about his channel is... Uh, he just kind of collects a little bit of everything, you know, on his channel. You'll see obviously a lot of, a lot of baseball, but you also see uh, soccer and hockey and NASCAR and football and basketball. And it's just kind of neat to see, you know, just the, just the little bit of variety of everything. And, uh, you know, seeing these guys share other sports of baseball, kind of has me motivated to, you know, start sharing a little bit of what I do have outside of baseball. So I am really going to try to push that in my in my uh, PC showcase videos down the road. So yeah, please go check him out. I'll link to his channel in my description. I should have given <laughs> Brian a shout out a long, long time ago. Uh, just never really got around to it. So yeah, please go check him out. Uh, worth worth the sub and worth checking out. Great guy in this community. So let's get into some. Uh, Ray Fossey is here. We got uh, his 1970 tops card. It's signed right there. You can see kind of by his knees in blue. Really nice signature and clean. And over here we have his uh, 1969 tops rookie card shared with George Woodson. There's uh, Fossey on the left. And then right in the middle we have his uh, tops big card. So Ray Fossey was born on April 4th, 1947. In Marion, Illinois, from what I've seen on uh, Google Map, that is in the southern part of Illinois. And right there, you can see it's uh, it's actually his 1970 top scar, just without the autograph. So that's kind of cool. Uh, he was raised in Marion, Illinois, where he uh, attended Marion High School, and he played football and basketball, and of course baseball. You know, it's uh, I really need to get into the images on these when I do the player spotlights. Man, this 1971 is just fantastic. Fossey ended up attending Southern Illinois University, where he was a uh, Saluki. And uh, throughout his career, he was a catcher that threw right-handed and batted right-handed. So Fossey was drafted in the first round of the 1965 Major League Baseball draft by the Cleveland Indians. And he made his Major League debut on September 8th, 1967 with the Indians. And they played the Kansas City Athletics where Fossey went 0 for 3 in his Major League debut. He had a 12-year Major League Baseball career. Um, 8 with Cleveland Indians. 3 with the Oakland A's. And then, you know, you kind of had the half seasons mixed here and there with the uh, Seattle Mariners and the Milwaukee Brewers. And he had another quick stint with the uh, Indians. His career stats, he had a 256 career batting average, 758 hits, and 324 RBIs, 61 home runs. He scored 299 runs. Uh, and he had 15 stolen bases and a career war of 12.8. So his career achievements, he was a two-time All-Star, a two-time World Series champion in 73 and 74 with the Oakland Athletics. And he was a two-time Golden Glove Award winner. And he's also in the uh, A's Hall of Fame. You know, it's uh, he's kind of kind of known as an old-school catcher and... He believed that, uh, you know, relationships with the pitchers and catchers was priority over uh, offensive stats. So he really pushed that kind of stuff, you know, on his on how he played the game, which I really respect that. Uh, and, you know, he's kind of known as uh, to the general fan base of baseball as the the catcher that Pete Rose had a run in with at home plate and um, during the 1970 All-Star game and caused a fra uh, fractured and separated shoulder on him. So it's kind of intense. <laughs> uh, you know, after his playing career, he became a colored commentator for the, for the A's from 1986 to 2021. And he passed away on October 13th, 
2021 after a 16 year battle with cancer, which he kept very private from, um, you know, just the, just people in general, just kept it very quiet and sounded like, so yeah, it's, uh, you know, just a quick little spotlight on Ray Fossey. Um, I'm too young to remember him playing. So, uh, you know, I loved reading up on this guy, you know, obviously I know of him and I just wanted to get a little more, uh, in depth. I had quite a bit of his cards. So all I really had to do was add his, I kind of added his tops big there randomly or not too long ago. And then his autograph was pretty reasonably priced. So, you know, I just decided to do a, a player finish off the player run and do a player spotlight on him. You know, really respect him and what he brought to Major League Baseball and one of those old school catchers that's, uh, you know, he'll be missed. So, yeah, please go check out Brian over at Hodges1455. Appreciate your guys' support and take care. Thanks again, guys.